Welcome back, everybody. Very special episode on the Vinyl Vault. Today, we have a mystery unboxing. Uh, we found a vinyl mystery box and then a random, like, toy mystery box at uh, the Record Archive in Rochester, New York, one of the greatest record stores in the New York area. Mm -hmm. And um, we, we saw these. We weren't planning on getting them. We just saw no, these mystery boxes. we saw them boxes. right when we walked in. We were like, oh, we have to get those. So... Let me show it off quick before we get into her. Five dollar mystery bag. Um, a lot of records in here. This feels yeah. thick. So the quality we don't know. Um, <laughs> we're gonna do that roulette style, where close your eyes, hand in the bag, pick one out. That one is yours. Do what you want afterwards. If you really hate it, you can toss it, give it away, whatever. Um, or you can keep it. Um, don't worry, I'm not strike any of the records. Oh, are they all? Wrapped or no? No, they're not. Uh oh. But I cannot see them. Uh, I just see the top bindings, and there's no words or anything. Right now. I would have no way of knowing. Um, so what she's gonna do, uh, going first, is she's gonna stick her hand in and grab one. Now just give us our, give us your thoughts on what what you just picked from the bag. So first pick is. Oh wait, did I just grab two? Oh no. No, you got one. <clears throat> Helen Reddy, Long Hard Climb. Now, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I've oh, it's, never... it's a book. Oh wait, Oh, whoa, it is whoa, a trifold! <gasps> this is actually pretty cool. Okay. This is really cool. I'm actually like curious. Dig in, show us, show, show us. I love that smell. Oh, you know it has the, the, the smell. Anyone who knows what the smell is. I don't know if I've ever heard of Helen Reddy. Oh, it sounds familiar. I, like I said, it, I'm sorry. My music no, I, I am actually, like, I want to, like, throw this on now. I want to know, like, what this is about. Well, lucky for you, you picked it, so you get to have it. Um, cool. Helen Reddy. I like how I've never had, this is my first little trifle of, uh, Yeah, that's pretty cool. Final here. It is a one disc. So you put a trifold cool. on a one disc, which is very unique. Um... Yeah. Let us know if you've heard of her before. I've never... Yeah, you, I, 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 I can't name a single piece. Yeah, but cool. By her. All right. What do we got here? Choose wise. Have you really? <laughs> <laughs> The best of bread. Now, that is iconic. I'm keeping this solely because it is the best of bread. Uh, I don't know what condition this is in. That's Pretty cool. cool. Honestly, we've been, we've been getting the, sure. uh, the booklets. Um, pretty cool uh, gatefold <clears throat> right there. Um, the best of bread. Um, I do love bread as food. Um, <laughs> so I'm assuming I'm going to like bread as a band. Um, there is a song called Truckin' on here. The final track, Truckin'. Super curious about. Uh, Diary. Uh, there's a song called If. Say 1973. What was this one made in? Electra Records. I know Electra for the Stooges and the Doors being on Electra Records. So I'm actually really curious about this. That guy kind of looks like my dad. Um, Which one? That guy. <laughs> um, I'm super curious. That's my first pick of the best of bread. That is sweet. This is fun. This is fun. We should just do this more. All right. Original mastering of Dark Side of the Moon. That would be really cool. Uh, they would know better. Whoa! 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 It is gold something. This is so cool. Oh, wait. Oh. That's the greatest hits. Barry... Ba the font is horrendous. Barry Whites? I want to say Barry Whites. Oh, yeah, Barry White. It's Barry White's Greatest, greatest Hits. hits. Um, this is so cool. A very oh cool vinyl. I love this gold. That is so cool. If the disc was gold, too, that would have been, uh, that'd been game over. It's never, never going to give you up. I'm going to love you just a little more, baby. These are classics. Huh. Cool. Definitely one you're gonna keep love, in your rotation just because of the gold. Love but the gold. Greatest hits you That's can't go wrong with. Really cool. Almost solid. Oh, All it's right. a book too. Oh, whoa! This one's really beat up, but you know it's cool. It adds to it. Adds character. Adds right? a little character. Someone took a bite out of the center of it when they were <laughs> hungry. They're a little hungry. And they found. Oh, they have like a. Can't be, can't be peeking. The don't peek. Uh, I, I stopped myself from peeking. Or else I'm going to have to keep the rest. So, uh, Whoa, like reflected off your face. Listen, 
All right. This was made in uh, 1975. Oh, we're in the 70s. We yeah, are in the 70s with these right. picks. All right. Well, I've been itching. Right. Like a kid putting his hand in a stocking on Christmas. <laughs> See what he's going to get. You know, we're not grabbing ones in the end. We're going to the middle. And we have Judy Collins, True Stories. Um, another artist off of Electra Records. Electra was just signing everybody back yeah. then. Uh, this, again, 1973. You know, I don't know if the other one was 1973, but it early was 70s. 70s. Um, Cook with Honey. The Dealer, Down in Luzon. Secret Gardens. If it, Fisherman's Song. I want to hear Fisherman's Song. Another booklet. I feel like they just all used to be booklets. That's like, sweet. You know yeah, because I mean? vinyls were, yet again, another chunk. Someone got hungry and, and, and took a bite right. out of. All right, let me see this disc. I'm, I really, so far, have enjoyed this mystery box experience. All right. We couldn't have put it back in. Um, Electra Records, like I said, I know them for the Stooges and the Doors. Um, I recognize the discs specifically of Judy Collins because this same design was on LA Woman, uh, on the LA Woman disc for the Doors on vinyl. Um, super interesting. The, the disc is in very good condition. Oh, no. Uh, it was in good condition until I saw one giant scrape. Um, <laughs> what do you expect? You get all these vinyls So side two, you might, you, you might be... Uh, it's all right. Might be out of the game. Yet again, another booklet uh, with a gatefold um, Very cool. album. Very cool. I'm going to listen to all these. Me too. I'm um, actually excited. And see what I enjoy. A trip down 70s lane. And this was $5. This is madness. It's five, yeah, so it's worth it. And I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, the fun itself is worth the $5. Even if you hate every record in here. It's but, still cool to also just listen to new music. Like, I enjoy doing yeah. that. Oh, this one's kind of cool. Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Ooh, it says Amvets Thrift Store. Miscellaneous. Well, they're giving us Amvets records. Who is this by? Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Oh, I thought that was just like $3. $3? We paid 5 for this. So you know what? I see what they're doing to us. <laughs> From 1969. Nice. The year your dad was born. Also nice. <laughs> Looks in decent shape. Yeah, it's a little scratched up, but what do you expect? I think my Beatles be ones are in worse condition. I think if I clean it, it might just be dust. If I clean it up a bit. It'll be oh, yeah, our little cleaning kits yeah. we got. That's Very super cool. cool. I'm curious about this one. But, uh. Feels like there's a couple more. Okay, that would work out. Would make it easy. We have Carly Simon. No secrets. Zero secrets. Whoa, the back scared me. What? The back scared me. <laughs> Aww. No, no, I'm sorry. It just caught me off guard. I was like yeah. talking to the camera, and then I looked, and I was like, <gasps> "Someone's staring." Yeah. At me. Oh, another. Another Electra. Is this an Electra only mystery no, box? No, because mine are an Electra. This one. Was... I'm grabbing only Electra yeah, artists. You are the only one that's grabbing those ones. Listen, I know I have Electra artists on here, but we have Carly Simon. No secrets. Um, this is 1972. So there's a common theme. I'm picking everything from 72, 73 to 75. And they're all on Electra Records. Um, songs being any cool. Uh, Night Owl. That's Night Owl is pretty cool. When you close your eyes. His friends are more fond of Robin. Very curious about that song. You're so vain. <gasps> I know um, that song. Whoa! Oh, take it. No, it's okay. Um, you picked it. Embrace me, you child. I'm curious about this because the song titles are really cool. Chill. Um, <laughs> And yeah, so we have Carly Simon, No Secrets. Uh, very cool back cover. Oh, we didn't look at the disc. Oh, wait, it looks like there's something else in there. Oh, this disc is putrid. <laughs> this disc is botched. Oh, man. No, it just looks a little dusty. Maybe some fingerprints on Bro. there. No, yeah, there's some gouges on there. Someone attacked this with a sword. The same. Same as the uh, butterfly thing. Good I don't think there's LA something woman. else in there. You know what? It could just be, well, they, it wasn't they, even in a case uh, around here. People are going to, yeah, people are going to attack me if I laid it up against myself. There is, oh, it's, oh, I thought this was like, is it? Oh, that's where the record was probably supposed to be yeah, in, there but it, it is. wasn't. You know what? I'm sorry, lady. She's pretty. I've never heard of her before. Very cool. Um, whoever didn't put the disc in the insert, now I can't enjoy my Carly Simon, so I hope you're happy. <laughs> Um, I think there's, it feels like there's one more in Does here. that top best of bread? I don't know. Love bread. 
One more? Yeah, it feels like. So that worked out perfectly. There you are. Oh, ooh, feels cool. Whoa! <laughs> Carpenters. <laughs> This so is we so have... cool. <gasps> Alright, I just looked in the bags. There's Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Look at this. That is sweet. This, I've never seen this kind of... What the it's heck? like a mailing envelope. Heck. Preserve the sound outside. I think I've heard of Carpenters before. They're striking me as 70s. Yeah, definitely. I don't just saying that because every single one we got was from the 70s. Says, sometimes it has it on here. Mm. The Carpenters just, they, they, they don't see decades. I love the, I got some really cool like looking albums. You think they'd put the date on you for the, the so, year. Some don't, like this one doesn't either. Have the we want to know when you made your absolute amazing tunes. Let's just look it up. The beauty of Google. Yeah, we do have Google at our disposal. Found this in here, too. There it is, Lovox for Record Archive, the great place we got these from. You can have catering, beer, wine, birthdays, weddings, graduations. Well, they have meeting. that that really cool... Yeah, that. yeah that's the, the restaurant. Uh, I tried that one at the camera. It didn't work. Um, oh. We got... Oh, wait. God, oh, the, the toy. The toy. All right. I'm gonna have you reach in the bag. Ah. Don't look. Do not peek. Yeah, there's a bunch of staples in there, so don't stab yourself. Oh, so oh, you got a Rubik's cube? It's already solved for me. I can just Boom. go around saying, "Look what I did." Okay. All right, my turn. All right, watch your fingies or staples. <laughs> oh, nice. Wait. Wait, I want to see it. Oh, it's a ring. It's a sparkle ring, you know? Yeah, it's a skull. It's cool. A little skull ring. Very cool. Put it on. It's stretchy, too, so any finger. One size fits Those all. are the ones that pinch the skin, though, sometimes. Let me see. Street credit card. Yes. Love one. that. Give someone nuts with these. My turn. Is there anything else in there? Oh, there is. I mean, this is the last thing in there. Oh, sweet. Bro, is that an iPhone? Probably for nuts. An iPhone 5 case? <laughs> mm. Yeah, look, you None should. None of us have an iPhone. I oh, my in... dad does. Oh, there. You can my have a nice dad, My dad <laughs> has an iPhone 5. You my, can have this. My phone is so big, so it's so funny that I got like the smallest. You could tell by the iOS on there. That's so funny. This thing has been sitting at Record Archive for a year. It's funny. Um, I might just throw it in my dad's case without him knowing, just to see his reaction. Uh, kind of cool, but the Rubik's cube itself um, makes up for my. Actually, no. You know what? This is the coolest thing. I like thing. the. This ring. is way better than the Rubik's cube. Um, this will protect my dad's phone. So overall, for five bucks, this toy haul is a steal. Um, I didn't know if it was going to be like music related or just like random stuff. No, it's not. <laughs> Take it easy. Um, but what do you think? I think the records are really cool. Yeah, I mean, I can't wait to listen to some of them. I'm um, curious. So you made out for five bucks with a Rubik's Cube and four very we curious each records. got four records. Honestly, I got three. But Wait, you uh, did? Yeah, I got that. Oh, that's awkward. Yeah, it is. But they're, they're, I'm sorry. It's all right. Um, you should have picked I, first. <laughs> listen, chivalry is not dead. I let the ladies go first. Um, I did get a cool ring out of it. Um, you can have this if you like. I'll solve it too while we're at it. Now, you know what? You're going to go home. You're going you're gonna to learn. Right. But... I really enjoyed this. I think this was, yeah, was potentially one of the funnest videos we've done yet. Um, yeah. A nice, fun mystery box unboxing. Um, I definitely, I'm going to be on the hunt. More record stores should do this. If I see them again, I'm buying them within a decent price range, of course. And um, mm -hmm. yeah, that was really fun.